in between the first and second games, but no coaching staff involved. Two Chinese players and the Chinese coaches prefer just to leave it to the players. Okay. They'll be happy. I know China has the men's singles title. And I don't think they're really too concerned which of these two men is to take it. That, of course, in contrast to the two men themselves. Second game, global play. Well, certainly neither player taking the allotted 90-second timeout before the start of this second game. And Lindan just indicating that the court needs to be mopped. Playing only his second ever Japan Open from last year. In fact, was seeded three. But lost in the round of last 16 to India's number one player, Pulala Gopichand. Oh, that's so clever. When a player gets to the net early, they have so many options. That time just guiding it across court. If not only the deception of the racket doing the work, the fact you take the shovel early does a lot of deception for you. What on earth was Lindan thinking about there? Miles in. Oh! Three, one. Lindan has had so many matches this week, so many hard matches. And this is where he's got to be mentally tough. Had to play 15 games in his five matches to get through to today's final. And when you're slightly tired, if things start to go against you, that's when you can just mentally begin to give in a little. And all credit to Shia Schwanzer because he's piling on the pressure trying to impose psychological dominance over his opponent. See, no wonder, God. has he cracked? Six love in the second game. Make that seven. Seven lost. Lindan offering little resistance at the moment. And it's really a question of does he have the mental strength to pick himself up? Well, time will tell. And that will certainly help his cause. But he has to start getting some points on the board. Can't leave it any longer. One. And indeed he does. It's a nice angle.
Oh, that is superb. The punch clear held the shot to the very last moment and punched it deep into the backhand corner. Perfect. Oh. That is superb. Got behind the shuttle, leapt in the air, and concentrated more on placement and angle. Nine, two. Oh, that's nicely done. Sides over to There's definitely nine. problems with that shoulder. Just overuse injury, I suspect. This is so typical of Shishwanja. One moment looking so much in command of every rally. And then for some reason just mentally goes off the boil. Let's his opponent back into a match. Another error. Would you believe it? Nine. Actually every time he's made an error and lost the rally. Shea asks his opponent to change the shuttle. Six, nine. Well, I should think the Chinese coaching staff must find this very frustrating to watch with such a world-class player. Shea Xuanzhe, inexplicable really that he can suddenly I mean, look so much in command ah! makes so That's many unforced errors nine, six. but I guess some will argue as long as he ha has the ability to regain that concentration and close out a match then I suppose what's the point in worrying about it just have this feeling that some of against some of the Nine, very best eight. players in the world just not able to have that luxury and then Dan apologizes for his luck Nine. Nothing he can do with a neck cord like that. Ah, oh, but now we have an interesting reaction from Shia Shwanjia. The outright winner on the return of serve. A little clinched fist. In other words, saying to himself, come on, let's get on with this. Says over. Six, of course, is the nine. problem. Very, very difficult at this level of sport to just switch your form back on at will. So it depends on what your opponent allows you to do. Says over nine six.
fails. And I should think that he's relieved to progress from nine. He'd been stuck there for a while. Oh. Sad. Over. That's about three Six. net cords in the last and half dozen rallies. Very nearly got it back to. Mm. Sex over ten six. Ambitious to try yet another net shot. Oh, oh that's fast. Eleven six. Well, no question, he has sensed the danger. He's regained his concentration and his focus. And he's regaining his authority. Size over six twelve. Mm, oh, dear me. Ah. Did I speak too soon? Seven, twelve. Drop shots to bring Lin Dan into the net. And then when the opportunity was right, the final smash across court for the outright winner. Opportunities are beginning to run out as far as this man is concerned. And Dan, all too aware that his opponent is just three points from this title. I was about to say inch perfect. From where I'm sitting, I'm looking straight down that line. And I have to say, I think she has been hard done by. Part of that was misjudgment, obviously, but I think part of the fact that he'd been looking to move forward after his smash 
and surprised by the fact that the shuttle was lifted. Oh, that's going to land in. Stand over. Ground. Nine. Mm, lovely clear. Look at the reaction. He wants this. An amazing rally. Thanks over. Nine twelve. Well that had everything. The momentum of that rally changing from one man to the other. Good attacking play, good defense. Subtleties. The dive there from Lindan. The refusal to give up. Nine twelve. Oh, it's dropped in. Ten, twelve. Twelve six up he was at one stage. Deficit, just two points. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my Sanctuary. goodness me. Well, sheer Tranger scrambling the shuttle back. It was such a woefully short lift. How on earth? Well, he can't believe it himself. Now from Lindan and it's championship pun point. She runs a Oh my goodness. Over ten fourteen. Well it's all happening here. Shuttle did drop long. Sands over 14 10. And so a second match point. <laughs> yeah. Getting the crowd involved. Oh, no idea. Yep. Shuttle getting caught in the lights. 10 14. So clever the way he varies the pace of his attacking shots. That one really a half smash. 
And now a third match point. This time he does yes. it. Shea Swanja wins the Japan Open. The number two seed. Thanks the crowd here. The scoreline there, 15-12, 15-10. The more important.